so hi everyone and welcome back to sensational lifestyle by Heidi so for today we will be reviewing and we will be talking about the my Burberry Burberry um, editions just like this is a one of the perfume that I don't have it in my collections and fortunately I got it as a present from my older son uh, this is one of the range in my Burberry um, it has a couple like the my Burberry Black, my Burberry Blush, my Burberry EDT, Elixir the Perfume, Festive, Limited Editions, and Limited Black Editions in the my Burberry um, range. So this one is was launched on 2014 as far as I know. Um, and behind the notes is Francis Cordicha. So when I heard it that he is behind the notes, ah, oh, I'm glad I got it. So this was inspired by the cult, French cult of my Burberry collections. That one of the famous French cults of my Burberry in the fashions range, and this perfume has a lot of notes going on. When I smell this, ah. Oh, kind of remind me of something but let's just talk about it first all the notes is in here that probably you will be surprised that there's a lot but it's very very different from the real perfume when you smell it so when it comes to the notes um, this perfume has a top notes of sweet pea bergamot mandarin grapefruits and lemon it has also this one has a middle notes of Quincy, Frisia, Geranium, Green Notes, Passion Spruits, and Gardenia, as well as the base notes of the Mass Rose, Rose Patchouli. It has a letter in here, also has a violet and patchouli. So uh, I got this from Christmas, and in the beginning, I was just saying, because I'm not into a Burberry, I told to myself, I'm pretty, pretty not. Um, confident about the sense but I'm glad that my son knows me better and he's getting uh, getting to know me better when it comes to the perfume I know my son knows me but when it comes to the perfume I'm very surprised the way that he pick up the perfume that I love it but when help with his girlfriend I know the first perfume that I had did me is a fruity now this one is more on um, women this is more on women. This is reminds me that when you go to the duty free, that's the one. That's the one that when you walk to the duty free, it just smells of a very airy, floral, clean type of expensive place. This is the one that I smell for this perfume. It has the opening for me. It has this very soapy, sweet smell. Let me smell it again. yes it has this sweet pea that it came out of course it still have this alcohol um from the beginning just like a snap of the finger because this is an automizer it just like the alcohol is the one who sustain the chemicals or the notes of the perfume and that's the first thing that you always smell when it comes to the automizer perfume i like the simplicity of this perfume i'm not pretty sure when it comes to this it, if it has a story behind because as all we know um francis Cordians, when it comes to the perfume and the bottles that it has always a story behind the bottle that he produced but he is behind the notes of this burberry i'm not pretty sure if he's still also behind the bottle of this type of perfume but yes this perfume has an opening of very sweet warm sweet pea for me has a kind of sharp of bergamot in here yeah a little bit greenish because of the green notes that it come out in here it's for me it's more on women um for this type of perfume i will rather go with this kind of adult women that to wear this this is more on a date night type of perfume that you can wear it in the winter spring or winter i think it's cold like this type of weather like 19 to 23 weather this is a perfect one it has this leather that come out 
after it dried down because I tried this for a couple of times. So the leather here is a kind of expensive Italian type of leather that I smell at work that I just wondering how much expensive is that type of leather and when you smell it the leather of the touch of in the air that is it but still has this violet has this leather has this a touch of the mass rose and rose in, in here that it can say it has a touch of a floral but more on green notes that's perfect as well for the warm weather but at the same time it's also good for um, spring and winter weather that you can wear it through the night so I can recommend this for this type of perfume I can recommend this for 35 20s if you like a a type of perfume that is a little bit a lady looks type of perfume that is warm floral um leather masky type of perfume this is one's perfect for you i love it it has this impact to me that i want to wear this in the date night so that's all i can say with this type of perfume so you can smell it to yourself by decant but this is a good because this is has a longevity that it will um long last until six to seven hours when i tried it and as all we know francis Gorgian is a type of perfumery that when he produces this perfume it will long last it also leaves a trail the shias is quite so good i smell it now in the air as i said this is a very sweet airy type of perfume that has a clean soapy type let's say soap or shampoo scents in here but once it's dry down the adultness of the perfume itself coming out the violet the leather the patchouli in here uh, green notes that has a treatment when it comes to francis cardian it has a similarity of the labo but more on francis cardian very unique that's all i can say guys so i hope you like this type of review so if you're new to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell so you will be updated with my every week video vlog. And if you enjoy this, please don't forget to comment, like, and share this family and friends. And have a great and wonderful day, guys. Bye for now and see you soon. Bye, guys!